I'm Maria Carosa. Some people think I'm a tough cookie, but I think I'm semi-sweet, just like my chocolate chips. My husband James and I, we're the owners of two successful bakeries in Staten Island. Here we make some of the best desserts in New York City, including cookies, cakes, cupcakes, a little bit of everything. This show is about our lives and others who love to bring sweetness into the world through baking. We love to visit other bakeries and are always seeking to innovate our products. Although James is more laid back than myself, I'm always looking to expand our business to ultimately build a cookie empire. I'm sure there'll be some bumps along the way, but with his cookies and my dreams, I know we'll have a delicious future. I walked in the shop and I saw water on the floor. I was like, not again, something going wrong, I'm not jealous area. Girls, we're missing a few tags, peanut butter, cookie, uh, cheesecake brownie bites. Yeah. What is this water in here? Katie, can you get the mop please? There's water here. So I pulled over Katie and I told her to mop the floor and she didn't say a word. She was Zita. That means she was mom's. She wasn't saying it, fessing up. I thought you got it all before. Well, now she knows. Do you think she's gonna find out the fridge you bought last night? I don't know. I, I mean, not. I mopped everything. The cookies were fine. So. I was off, so it's all gonna be on you. Yeah. Maria? Yes? Hey. James is on line one. Okay, thank you. James? Yes. How you doing? Good. Listen, I think we have a problem again with the refrigerator. Yeah, what's wrong? It, it's leaking water. I had the girls mop it up this morning. Yeah. The bakers told me they thought it was broken, so I called the refrigerator guy. But then I found out uh, that it was really, it was turned off last night and wasn't turned back on. What do you mean it was turned off? I think uh, the girls were cleaning the refrigerator and uh, they forgot to turn it back on. I asked them to clean the refrigerator but not to shut it off. I just, <clears throat> they didn't say anything to me. Well, that's what I found out. Oh my God, all right, let me call them down here. Meanwhile, she left the refrigerator off all night, which meant the condensation was building, it was de-icing, and that's why there was water all over the floor. I'm gonna get her. Wait till I get her. Katie! Come down here! You want to see me? Katie, the refrigerator was left off all night? When I asked you to mop, you didn't say anything. Well, when we cleaned it last night, we took it off, we turned it off, and then I guess before we left, we forgot to turn it back on. That is not good, Katie. You could have lost hundreds of dollars worth of product. You're the supervisor, you're in charge. Whoever cleaned it with you, you're the one that has to be able to be more responsible and put it back on. Maria, we were here until 8 o'clock last night. I was running late. I had a date at 8 o'clock with my boyfriend. He got mad. He's yelling at me. He's calling me. So I just wanted to get out of here. Honestly. Cookies come first. Your boyfriend comes later. Absolutely, I will definitely learn from my mistake. There's very few things that you need to do before you leave. One is you gotta make sure the cookies are at a correct temperature before you leave the shop. If it's too hot, you have to lower the heat. If it's too cold, you have to lower the air conditioner. You have to be aware we have a lot of chocolate we have a lot of things that need refrigeration. You, you as a supervisor need to remember that. 